Hi everyone, Assalamualaikum Okay, today I would like to share with all of you About the latest edition of APA APA, the uh, citation style Okay, American uh, Psychological Association I believe that all of you Maybe many of us that are using this uh, APA uh, edition So, but uh, maybe uh, many of us are uh, not aware about the the latest uh, or uh, up to date edition, uh, the newest let, uh, edition that we call the APA Seven edition. Okay, so you uh, you can refer also the at the um, uh, this uh, page I found in the Facebook. Uh, they mention what is the the most notable changes in the. APA 7 edition okay uh, you can go to the page online this is statistician so uh, maybe they will, can help you I, I will put the URL uh, in my description in my YouTube so you can refer uh, after this but you can also refer to my video I will try to explain one by one what is the the, the most notable changes in the APA 7 edition so I would like to credit this page online this statistician and then I would like to share with, with all of you about the uh, APA 7 edition. At the end of this video, I would like to show you how to update your main daily. Okay, uh, how to uh, to update uh, from the APA 6 now, okay, to the, the current version, APA 7 edition. Alright, so the first of all, okay, APA 7 edition, they have a lot, uh, a lot of the changes. Uh, but uh, and we can say the uh, we can say major changes also because some we are familiar with some uh, the the rules of the APA APA uh, citation style but now we have the new uh, changes so it maybe can be surprised and maybe you must aware about this because the seven seven edition some of the changes are quite different before the the previous uh, edition okay the first one okay. As mentioned in this page, is the publisher locations not included? Included, okay. Before this, our public publisher location, or we call the city of publication, okay. They have not uh, before this is available and uh, after uh, after the title, this one the title, and then before the uh, the publisher's name, okay. But nowadays for the seven uh, APA seven edition, do, we do not need to. Uh, to mention about the publication, publisher location or city of publication. For example, uh, the name of one book in Malaysia, Kuala Lumpur. Uh, uh, for example, um, uh, Macro Hill or something like that. Okay, so no need to put the uh, the publication, publisher location or city of publication. Alright. So the second one is. Uh, we can do the in-text citation. In-text citation now, nowadays for the latest uh, edition of the APA, no need sh uh, longer. The length is uh, shortened only. Okay, because before this we must mention all the authors. Uh, if three authors, four authors, and then for the second citation and so on, then at all. But nowadays for the first citation, in-text citation, you just put there uh, Taylor at all. That's all. So it's shortened. So in the in-text citation in your right thesis writing, only put the only one author, then at all, and then year in the bracket. Okay, that is the second changes. Second change that available in the uh, the latest edition of APA. Okay, number three, up to twenty authors in the reference list. Okay, before this, maybe uh, it's uh, not all the authors will be mentioned in the uh, in the reference list or bibliography list. Uh, only one, two, three, four, five, six, and then da 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 dash and seven. But now, now for the latest edition, you can we must uh, update uh, or we must put all the authors up to twenty authors only, and then uh, two thousand eighteen. Okay, so so it means that uh, you can put the up to twenty authors in the reference list for the one because sometimes. You have about 50 authors in one article sometimes you you may found that uh, 100 or 200 authors in the uh, one article but you may uh, allow to uh, to to mention to to state that in the reference list for one article up to 20 authors only okay all right so instead of the seven authors before this Okay, the f number four is a DOI. Before this, DOI just put the number. Start from one zero point 
number 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 slash uh, something like that okay but for the latest edition for DIY you must put the URL okay HTTP uh, S uh, uh, colon slash the backslash backslash DIY dot org backslash and then the number or DIY okay so you must put the the URL please remember that okay then the number five is the setting web page okay before this the previous version even six or five uh, uh, six or fifth edition of the APA you must put the uh, retrieve form retrieve from if you refer to the any website uh, as your reference mat from as your reference material but now for the latest edition you must put this one is a uh, actually no need to put the ref retrieve from okay just after the the title of the uh, the title of the web page and then who uh, uh, we call the 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 platform or the website of the name of the website of the, uh, the, the that, that materials and then just straight uh, put the URL no need to put the retrieve from okay there is number five and then uh, citing ebooks okay uh, before this we must put the the format or the platform or device that you use uh, when you refer to the ebooks but nowadays you just put the the, the latest edition you do not need to put the uh, the format platform and device but you just put the uh, publisher publisher before this publisher is not it's not necessary to put in the uh, ebooks but uh, the latest edition you must put the uh, publisher for example springer nature emerald ebooks uh, for example amazon amazon.com or so on uh, uh, they have a lot of the Taylor, Taylor and Francis ebook and so on okay so you must put the name of the publisher okay number seven contributors other than authors okay clear that uh, for citing contrib uh, contributors other than authors and editors Be before this we just uh, we must put the authors and editors but some of the uh, subject for example uh, performing arts uh, films uh, songwriter and so on so they have the they, are, they, they refer the material that not as author but the other contributor so for example this one film director tv series executive producer podcast episode host officer webinar maybe webinar you can refer to a webinar what we call that that one is the instructor okay not not only the author and editors okay so you can refer photograph photographer okay the eight uh, the uh, the other one the, uh, the changes is a uh, uh, APA suggests uh, before this if you must if the singular you must refer to he or she but now you must put there even the the citation uh, the the materials the author is only one he or she but you just uh, put uh, change that not he or she but you put they okay uh, even uh, there okay his or her no need to put his or her assessment he or she or he is cited but they are cited okay even the author is only the one percent okay and then uh, be sensitive to labels okay do, do not put the the poor okay people uh, change the, the the more proper words okay uh, sentence the people living in the uh, pover uh, poverty okay and so on okay you can refer to this one appropriate uh, level of specificity or so or not over 65 65 uh, 560s and so on just put the people age 65 to 75 so mention specifically okay and action participant don't put the action participant please uh, spell out uh, uh, who are the action participant there uh, Vietnamese Cambodian Malaysian Thai and so on so you must spell out to be, uh, you should be specific okay and then um, uh, font uh, before this uh, APA is a uh, suggest or only use for the Times New Roman as a font type and uh, the font size is 12 but now uh, APA suggests more than that you can also use the Arial 11 Arial area as a font type font size 11 Georgia 11 Calibri uh, 11 Lucida Sans uh, Unicode 10 for the font size okay so there's more option now in the APA okay it's good for us okay uh, no more running head okay and then update heading style okay heading style all uh, uh, now bold and title case okay title case means that uh, all the um, uh, in heading the first letter for the first word must be a capital letter the rest must be a 
small letter and then if the second word capital letter and then the word uh, the rest of the alphabet must be small letter and so on okay all right so you can refer this one okay d is the changes how how to change the apa uh, six edition to the uh, seven edition in the uh, we call the uh, in in mendeley okay so you can go to the mendeley desktop okay make sure you open the your mendeley desktop and then you can go to the view okay view make sure you go to the citation style okay so you can see all this one is the selected that uh, maybe you use or bef uh, default of the citation style in mendeley so i go to the more styles okay i go to more style click here when you go to more style actually all these uh you can see this one this one this one all the citation style that available in the uh we call um, uh in mendeley okay for example okay you, you can see this one okay now you are selected the uh american psychology association apac edition but uh you cannot see the update available okay uh, when you go to uh, america for example let's like say uh you want to update the american sociological association acasa so update available right so you just like click right click your update style okay so from the 2018 now they will go to the the newest version february 19 okay 2019 okay how about uh six edition <coughs> okay uh, excuse me all right so you can right click you just right click and update style the the latest edition that in the my mendeley is a, at the uh, 8th of july i think uh, 9, 2019 now i want to update style okay now uh, they will change to the american psychological uh, association apa 7 edition so now you may use the latest edition of the uh, edition of the apa okay 7 edition okay so then done okay use this style please uh, don't forget to uh, select and then done after you done okay you you can put the sync and so on okay Oh, but I will. I want to go to the my my for example my 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 word. So please make sure that now is a APA six right. So I want to go to more styles. Okay, I want to show and then done. What has happened? I think you must. Uh, okay, let's see. Eh? Just wait. Just wait. Maybe uh, still updating. <laughs> okay, uh, still updating. Or you may restart the the Microsoft Word and then you re reopen the Microsoft Word and then you can choose the APA seven. Okay, I think it's take time because we just updated uh, the edition in the Mendeley. Now I want to try to open the Word here. So they will change to the APA seven, the newest version. And then after that, after you choose the APA seven edition, please make sure you refresh. Okay, uh, look at that. Ah, okay, now now it's done. APA 7 edition click here and then you can click refresh so they will refresh all the the uh, we call the uh, our document and then uh, you can see the differences after you update the newest version or newest edition of the APA so uh, please try so I hope uh, you you don't worry about the uh, do manually and so on because and not or Mendeley will do for you. If you are using Ennot, you can update the Ennot version. Uh, if you are using Mendeley, just now I show you how to update in the Mendeley. So you can see this one, all this one, all the we call the the references, the in-text session, uh, in session will be updated. You can see this one. Before this, DOI, DOI is an uh, only the number, but now we have the the URL. Okay. I think that's all for for this uh, uh, session this video I just give you brief please go to the website uh, for example uh, Mendeley if you're using Mendeley you can go to the Mendeley or APA style dot APA to know to know more what is the differences or changes from the sixth edition to seventh edition what is the newest uh, changes or newest uh, style that available in the for the APA so if you're using APA please refer read read as a uh, in the brief in brief and then you can change uh, the newest edition in the 
Mendele. All right, or oh, and not. Okay. Thank you very much. See you again. Please subscribe my YouTube channel and please uh, also join my Telegram. Okay. Thank you. Bye. Assalamualaikum.